Hey, what's going on? Steve here from Black Dice. I want to do a quick video on this. So I've installed some PBF film on this and, you know, had some issues. Obviously, you can see little bubbles and stuff like that. It's not as terrible as I thought, but the reason I had these issues is because the sunlight was shining through literally on the vehicle and I was fighting it from drying it up and like it was tacking a little sooner than I needed. Lesson learned, you know, just move it over when the sun's shining in and, you know, I probably need a little bit more slip solution because it was drying fast. But uh, I try not to use too strong a slip solution because I like it to tack nicely. Anyway, so they put the window back on this, I guess, after I was done. And I guess the window slipped and nailed this. But let me get a good view here and see. That's just glue left behind. This is glue. It didn't damage the paint which is awesome, but it definitely ripped the film. Now, if this film wasn't there and I pulled it back off because I had some issues, you know, with the sun and stuff and it didn't tack down as nicely in here and I got some lines in there, that this paint would have been damaged. Like, clearly, it would have been, you know, gouged or scratched. But this shows, a prime example, shows how good of a job it did holding up with it. So good thing I left it on and didn't pull it off that day. I didn't pull it off because I wanted to see how it would turn out after it cured and dried up. And it actually turned out better because I had some more issues up in here. You know, I, th I think it was up here. It was probably mostly down here. But, um, yeah. So, anyway, next thing we're going to do is this plastic flange here to get this better. Because it got bunched up. To get this better, I'm going to take it off. So, you can see, they do come off. I've taken this one off. It's easy to remove, you just gotta put pressure on it. But the other problem is these lights push out, so it pushes the film out. So it makes it harder to get the film down without extra material. So I had to put a relief cut in there, which I didn't want to do. But next time I'm gonna take this off and see about getting these lights off as well. And then I could just wrap it easily. So yeah, stay tuned. This is a trial and error and learning how to do these golf carts. You know, for full protection so we can just pump them out. All right, later.